because self-harm not only in the veteran community and the military but in special forces is extremely prominent and one of my best friends and teammates that i love the most just took his life after our last combat deployment so yes i am passionate about this and i am sick and tired of seeing former soft veterans make this story all about me 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 i said this obviously isn't some conspiracy theory with a man on the run to mexico it's a global war on terror veteran active duty soldier green beret who's suffering and mentally ill global war on terrorism we were in afghanistan we were in iraq those guys saw a horrific thing but it's not the horrific things that are causing the problems right now. the problems are caused by blast exposure the resonant frequency of our firearms firing bullets is the same resonant frequency in our brain that's causing these micro tears that are causing TBI and CTE. Now, understand this. The amount of bullets you fire in training leading up to going on deployment far and exceeds anything you'll do in the actual battlefield you fire so much more ammunition now when you get down range you got other factors to put into into play there you got rpgs going off 